Okay, so let's solve this problem. So find the sum of the integers from 20 to 130 and are divisible by 5. So first, we need to find the number of integers divisible by 5 from 20 to 130. So using this formula and in the given, since 20 is the first term, that's a sub 1, and 130 is the last term, that's a sub n. Then substitute now to this formula to solve for n. So a sub n, that's 130, equals a sub 1, that's 20, then plus n is the unknown, minus 1, times d, the common difference, since divisible by 5, so therefore the common difference is 5. Then simplify, so transpose this positive 20, so that becomes negative 20, then equals, distribute this 5, so 5 times n, that's 5n, and 5 times negative 1, that's negative 5, then this 130 minus 20, that's 110, and transpose this negative 5, that becomes positive 5, then equals 5n, then this 110 plus 5, that's 115, equals 5n, then to solve for n, divide both sides by 5, so n now is equal to, so this 115 divide by 5, so we have 115 divide by 5 equals, that's 23. So therefore, there are 23 terms divisible by 5 from 20 to 130. Then to find the sum of the integers using this formula, so we have now S sub n, so the sum of the integers equals n and n is 23, n over 2, n times 2 times a sub 1 and a sub 1, that's 20, then plus n, so n is 23, then minus 1, times the common difference, that's 5. Then simplify, so we have S sub n equals, so this one is 23 over 2, then times 2 times 20, that's 40, then plus 23 minus 1, that's 22, then times 5. Then we have S sub n equals 23 over 2 times, this one is 40 plus 22 times 5, that's 110. Then we have now S sub n equals 23 over 2, then times this 40 plus 110, that's 150. So therefore, the sum of the integers divisible by 5 from 20 to 130 equals, so we have this 23 divide by 2, equals then times 150 equals that's 1725 so 1725